What's up, YouTube? Hope you guys been out there building shit. Using your God-given hands, taking on projects, building, fixing, creating. In this episode of Worth Shop, I'm going to give you guys a step-by-step -step breakdown how to change the clutch in a square body Chevy. So let's get to it. Remove the passenger side carpet trim. Take off the four-wheel drive shift knob. It's in your way. Then, take out the shifter boots. Here they are removed. Push down and twist to remove the shifter from the transmission. Push the floor mat over and out of your way. I ripped the pad just to expose the tunnel. Then removed all the tunnel bolts. Took out the transfer case shifter from the bottom. Disconnected the rear drive line and carrier bearing. Followed by removal of the front drive line. Disconnected the battery so we don't get no arcing out when we unbolt the starter and leave it hanging. Disconnected the speedometer cable and started removing the cross member bolts. We supported it all with a transmission jack and another jack before sliding it all back out of our way. Next, we removed the bell housing but had to get the oil filter out of our way for the final bolt. Took the bolt off the end of the clutch lever and finished removing the bell housing. Next off was the pressure plate followed by the flywheel. Almost fully disassembled at this point. You could say we're about halfway done with this job. Don't forget your pilot bushing or bearing. That pressure plate was about half gone. And flywheel was definitely scarred up. But that's alright. We got some new stuff. Make sure you get new bolts for the pressure plate and the flywheel. Because they stretch when you torque them in. Alrighty guys, I hope you learned something. I think you've got it from here. You just reassemble it the opposite of how you took it all apart. Hit like, subscribe for future content. I hope that you guys got something out of this. Hope you learned something. And I hope above all else that it gives a newbie or somebody that doesn't have the experience to do this the confidence to take on this project. So till next time, believe in what God gave you. Keep building shit. Now, the most challenging part of this entire process is going to be not doing burnouts and running it hard. You got to kind of break in that clutch. Drive it easy for the next thousand miles or so.